know you've been a good friend And that's in the thick and thin And I know it's never gonna end Cause you've been a good friend Hello, YouTubers! Good afternoon, good evening. Okay, panic, panic, panic. Price gouging, panic. Oh my God. If you read, the CDC clearly says that although the ideal number for hand sanitizer is 70%, most hand sanitizers only has 60% alcohol value in it. It's your bottle because I have one in my purse right now and it says the alcohol content it's 60%. And the bottom line is this. This virus has what they call an envelope. And I've done a little research on this. And the envelope is there's no magic number for the alcohol. No magic number. But it is sensitive and to the alcohol. Alcohol kills the virus. If you're close enough, the alcohol that you have is going to kill the virus. Now, there is no alcohol left on the shelf in several of the Walmarts. I mean, zero. And not in the back room. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of freaking alcohol that's being sold. And that's 70% alcohol, okay, of rubbing alcohol. If you are, if you use vodka to make a hand sanitizer, you use vodka, you need to buy over 150 proof. 190 proof is best, like Everclear. But if you can't get that, because here in Florida, I'm in Florida right now, here in Florida, Vodka, sorry, I to put my seatbelt on. Uh, here in Florida, it's illegal to sell anything over 151 proof. Yeah. I know that because I make, I just made a tincture, and it's still in the process of being made, a tincture that I have at home. An oregano tincture, which is made with um, the highest grain of alcohol that you can have, which is consumable to the body, and fresh oregano, and you put it in a, a container and it sits for five, three to six weeks so that all the herbs can, and the alcohol, and then you strain it. So, bottom line is, is that in Florida, you cannot get anything higher than 151 proof alcohol legally it's illegal to sell it if you don't believe me look it up google it that's where i found out and then when i went in the store to buy it i asked them hey can i get 190 proof and they're like we can't sell 190 proof it's against the law in florida um try to get the highest volume alcohol you can get if you're going to make your own hand sanitizer okay and then you're going to use aloe vera gel as your substance to your segue to, you know, put it on, put the um, sanitizer on you. Like the aloe vera gel, which is also healing so that the alcohol doesn't dry out your skin. <laughs> that kind of worse. Coronavirus. Watch my video, coronavirus. And I got the knock by the popo. Yeah, my video I just put out this morning. I'm gonna try to get this one out tonight. What's today? Today is, um, goodness, today's Thursday, so that means that I'm gonna watch Blind Views tonight. The Blind Views live chat. So, you can use 50% alcohol if that's all you can get. 
because the virus is sensitive to alcohol. You can't get anything else. That's all you can get at the dollar store or at Walmart. Walmart, did the only they didn't even have 50% on the shelf anymore. Everything's gone at the Walmart I was at. Everything's gone. I went shopping to get um, some things for my weekend. And I was like, oh my gosh. When I was in the uh, pharmacy area. Yeah. Totally gone. I happen to have like 150 proof, 155 proof alcohol, consumable alcohol that's being used right now to make a tincture, the tincture with oregano. That oregano tincture kills bacteria. It kills bacteria and it kills fungus, it kills all that stuff. It kills infections. Oregano does a lot for killing um, bacteria and healing. Okay, so I met Walmart YouTubers. No alcohol, only hydrogen peroxide. Nothing. Okay, so um, Walmart is shelves are empty. See, I got Danny hanging on my arm, and I've been to two Walmarts one in Fort Charlotte and one in Fort Myers. But this one in Fort Myers has a separate liquor store freestanding, which is the first time I've seen that. And I'm gonna go see what if they have any alcohol in there. The highest proof. Be back. Okay folks. So I got the Everclear. This is the highest volume alcohol that they have in the store. They didn't have a little bottle. They only had this big bottle which is the fifth and it is 151 proof and it's 75.5% alcohol by volume grain alcohol and I'm going to keep this in my house but when I get to Illinois I'm getting me some 190 proofs because I use it to make my tinctures with but I will also use it with my hand sanitizer. Because really, this Everclear at 75% alcohol is even better than the 75% the that you buy rubbing alcohol in the store. Danny's in the back seat. I got big surprises coming up for me this weekend. Not surprises, got big plans, got big things happening. I'm so excited. Uh, one of them is I'm gonna be meeting up again with the full tiny house at a Encore campground. I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna actually get a campground space for a couple of days, yep. I am. That's another surprise. I don't normally do that, but I'm going to do it. going to do it. So I'm going to have full hookup. <laughs> full hookup. And, um, oh, I don't think there's sewer there. I think it's just electric and water, but still, whatever. Full hookup. It's going to be great. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And I just can't hide it. I know, I know, I know, I know. Oh. I'll be back and tell you more if I got more. 